Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you three steps for the perfect winged eyeliner. I will also show you different eyeliner products that you can choose from and which type of brushes are easier to use. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit on the notification bell so you can get notified for all my latest videos. There are so many different eyeliner products and sometimes it gets a little bit overwhelming because we don't know what to use. Liquid eyeliner with brush applicator gives a very defined look, although it is a little bit more difficult to control. The bristles are thin and long and you need a little bit more practice to get a straight line. Next we have liquid eye pen which looks like a sharpie. They are very easy to use. One of my favorite type of products is the felt tip applicator. The tip of the brush is like a sponge in a conical shape. It looks like a liquid eye pen but the main difference is that the felt tip applicator is softer and easier to control. The most suitable product for beginners is the gel eyeliner because you can use it with any brush that you have and it is easier to learn. You can use brushes with any eyeliner product that you have. You can just apply a little bit of product on the back of your hand and then with your brush take the product and apply it on your eyes. With a precise eyeliner brush you can create any line that you want with a little bit of practice. I never use bent liner brushes because I feel a little bit more comfortable with angled brushes and as you can see I have quite a few and I prefer angled brushes because I can create small lines like that and then I can connect my lines and create the perfect winged eyeliner. For this video I will use iStudio Lasting Drama Gel Eyeliner by Maybelline in the color black and I will also use a precise eyeliner brush by Essence. Do you like gel eyeliners? I do! Step 1. Define the lash line. To stabilize my hand I touch lightly my cheekbone with my little finger. I start by applying the product from the inner corner of my eye to the two thirds of my eyelid, very close to my lashes in small lines like dashes. I stop where my iris ends. Step 2. Create the wing. For me, it doesn't work the imaginary line from the outer corner of my eye to my eyebrow because it looks like a curve because of my bone structure and it makes my eyes look more puffy and more hooded than they are. With this angle of my wing, my eyes are not looking elongated or I cannot do the cut eye effect that I like. So what you can do to find the correct angle for your wing is that you can experiment. You can take your line completely outwards and see if you like it. For me it works a little bit more upwards so I will do it somewhere here. I always like doing my wings one at a time so I can make the same wings and this is the angle that works for me. You can experiment and find the correct angle for your eye shape. Step 3. Connect the lines. This part can get a little tricky. I don't start exactly at the end of the wing so I can leave the end pointed. After that I apply my brush towards my lash line and then I fill that in. If you are starting now with eyeliner, don't get discouraged, you can do it! Don't forget to share this video with all your friends, everybody needs to know how to create the perfect winged eyeliner. For more eyeliner tips and tricks, give this video a huge thumbs up. If you want to learn more about makeup and also see some more videos from me, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I will see you in my next video. Bye!